years ago. Uh, what uh, what yeah. got you into the business? No, really, it was the thesis on many of these countries are talking about net zero goals, mm -hmm. like reaching them by 2030, 2040, 2050. And, I felt like without nuclear, there is no chance of that. Um, also, I was looking at clean tech, green tech, and a lot of the, I would say, if you look at solar and wind, it seemed to me like it plateaued. And it needed nuclear, but new nuclear technologies really captivated me, and, and this is what brought me to this world. Um, and my background is capital markets. I used to work right here at 60 Wall Street uh, for Deutsche Bank, so close by to the exchange. And uh, I never thought I'll be uh, a founder of a nuclear tech company, but I really believe in the future of nuclear. Okay, so should, should note, uh, Nano trades under the ticker symbol NNE. Um, in terms of the priorities of your business, how have those shifted with the rise of AI and all of the, the huge amount of energy that it requires. How has that impacted your business and your priorities? Yeah, I mean, it, it's been such a crazy uh, <laughs> move last year because, you know, many of these big tech uh, companies realize the same thing, that they need nuclear as a baseload energy provider for the future if they want to scale out these massive data centers. And, you know, lucky enough, Nano was able to acquire uh, from bankruptcy a leading uh, micro reactor technology company that that was a higher energy system that was able to power these data centers in the future and, and our technology is used modular it could be clustered we have IP and patents around that which we're, we're very proud of um, because many of these other companies don't have that mm -hmm. um, so we have a vast portfolio of IP now and we are building it now under the University of Illinois and that is the next step for us. We reestablished that collaboration, and in the next few months, we'll be drilling, uh, doing some geological site characterization. So now, nano, everything is, is coming to life, I would say, not just on paper, but now it's going to be on, on the ground. Two